this season. We're so excited that it's coming back for a second season. Uh, are there any differences between season one and season two that we can expect? Well, I think um, we kind of dip into romantic comedy territory in season two, and there are also lots of uh, characters who end up uh, um, relying on people in unexpected places. Yeah. Did I say that? Yeah, yeah, I think so. I think um, on one hand, in season one, there was a lot of exterior like cases and things to solve. I think in season two, Alan did a great job of just of kind of making it all about us. The yeah. whole season is, is really just kind of a, a web of our backstories and our relationships and it kind of just rem remains tangled there and we don't always have to be introducing like, well, guess what happens this and we gotta solve this, which I, I think we're stronger for. Yeah, ABC has such a great lineup of shows. You guys are part of Shondaland now. Um, what is your favorite ABC show aside from yours? Oh, yeah. I actually, I, I keep it in the family. I love a Scandal and How to Get Away with Murder. Yeah, I love them. And they just came back with a bang this last week. Yeah. Uh, I've loved Grey's Anatomy from the inception point. Uh, so, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm still, I still love Grey's. I like, uh, I actually like the Goldbergs, um, and I love Blackish because I have a friend. I mean, that is one of the funniest shows. I really feel like on television. Yeah, and it's such a. What I love about ABC is the diversity of content that they have, and they yeah. try so many new things. They're not afraid to take a risk. Yeah. And Blackish is one of those shows. For Speechless. Sure. I love. Speechless. That is a good yeah, show. It's really yeah. good. Yeah. 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 That's a yeah. Awesome one too. yeah. Um. So. So, um, do you think, um, okay, so Rose, let's, let's talk about uh, the strong characters that, that Shonda Rhimes creates. What is it like playing a badass woman on TV? Well, I kind of am a badass woman. You so. are. You no, are. No, no, no. She no. plays you herself. Have <laughs> No, but I, I'm joking. Like, okay, so I actually find this character to be one of the easier characters that I have gotten the opportunity to play in my career. I love her, and it's the first time I um, have been able to look glamorous, and I'm, I'm eating it up. But like, strength is definitely my strong suit, as you could say. So, I love it. I love it. Fantastic. So let's do a really quick rapid fire of cast superlatives. Mm. You guys ready? Mm. <laughs> okay, so who would you say, um, your cast members, they're not they're not running each other out on this one, but who would you say is the clumsiest person on set? Peter. <laughs> Come on. That is the most okay. definitive one that we've got. Okay, okay, yeah, okay. okay. Am, am I wrong? Are yeah, you see yeah. me? No, no. Okay, no I, mean, I swear, this time I actually <laughs> wasn't. Yes. No. I never ran. No. I never walked into one of those ABI. Oh, wait, no, I did. Oh. I did walk into that door. <laughs> we have yeah. glass walls in yeah. the office no. where That's we were. That's just you're asking for it at that mm. point. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Who is the uh, funniest person on set? Jay. No. Yes. 100%. No. It's not. Yes. It's, it's yeah. unanimous. You are the funniest person on set. Yeah. If you if you had to choose someone, who would it be? <sighs> Yourself. Come it on. Would, it would probably be Jay. Yeah. Four for four. Four for four. You can edit that, right? Yeah. You can edit that out. Yeah. Uh, um, who is the one take wonder? Oh. That's a great question. Who it's always gets their lines me. right? Yeah. It's not me. Yeah. <laughs> when there's a scene between Danny and Val, that takes yeah. a little longer. Yeah. A little long. No, it's got to be, it's probably John Sim. Oh. I, I, I feel like he works pretty fast. Yeah. 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 And, and opposite of that, who will always forget their lines? Oh, you're looking at the two people oh, right here. Exactly. You literally nailed it. Um... Well, well, I have an excuse this year. No, I you do. Yeah, I have no it's excuse. It's been bad. Congratulations, by the way. Oh, thank you. But pregnancy brain is not a joke. Yeah. Like, it would, like, I almost, it's kind of hilarious to the degree in which I forget my lines. Like, it, and I would study extra hard, but oh my goodness. But, yeah. You have an excuse. I, what's your excuse? I just have a vaguely low intelligence. <laughs> <clears throat> so that's cool. <laughs> At least you're honest. Yeah. <laughs> and on that note, yeah. thank you so much for taking the time thank to talk you. to us. Thank you.